how is it going samsung users mr android here welcome back to a brand new video on this channel well finally i got the official one ui 5 update on my galaxy s20 ultra i have already enrolled for the beta and after testing all the beta versions samsung has provided the stable release uh, with that being said i have already installed the stable one ui 5 update on my galaxy s22 ultra and the first thing i have noticed is they have improved the animations and now it feels much better and smooth when compared to the one ui 4.1 i will be showing you all the animations one by one but before that let me show you some of the best and useful features of one ui 5.0 stay tuned and watch this video till the very end also let's aim for at least 1000 likes on this one so drop a like leave a comment and let's get started one of my favorite feature is the lock screen customization. Now if you long press on the lock screen, you get a lot of customization options. You can change the clock style, you can add different colors and there is an option to change the font as well. This was already available in the good lock application but now you really don't have to install an additional app on your phone. You get all these amazing features in just a single click. With One UI 5, you can now combine different widgets of the same sizes into a single one. All you have to do is simply long press and drag it on top of each other. Then you can swipe left or right to find the widget that you're looking for. You can also edit this by removing the widgets that you don't use quite often. I think it's a really nice feature and once you start using it, you can actually save a lot of space and it makes your home screen clutter free. Another useful feature that Samsung added in One UI 5 helps you to quickly open multiple apps in a split screen window. Let's say I'm watching a video on YouTube and I quickly want to open Play Store. I just need to swipe with my two fingers like this and it opens the split screen window. Not only that, if I swipe from the top right, it opens that application in a pop-up window. I think it's one of the fastest way to open multiple applications in a pop-up or split screen window and it definitely improves your multitasking experience. To enable these additional gestures on your phone, go to your settings, select advanced features and then select labs. Here you get two brand new options, just go ahead and turn it on. Samsung also added a good lock module called camera assistant. So you just need to open your good lock application and here you will find a brand new module called camera assistant. I will make sure to drop a direct link in the description below. Once you have installed this module, what it does is, it basically unlocks more features related to your camera. Let's say, if you enable this option that says soften pictures, it will smooth out sharp edges and textures in all your pictures. Then we also got auto lens switching. Once you turn it on, it will allow the camera to choose the best lens based on the zoom, lighting and distance to the subject. So the camera will automatically decide which lens will be used for taking that particular picture. Other than this, there is an option called faster shutter. And this will help you to speed up the shutter speed by capturing few frames. Guys, I'm also planning to make a dedicated video on good lock where I will be mentioning all these features one by one. So stay tuned for that. Now let me show you all the animations so you can see how smooth the UI feels. As you can see all these animations looks beautiful and this time they have actually worked on the animations. I think it feels much better and smoother when compared to the previous version. So these are some of the best features of One UI 5.0 and I have already made a detailed video where I showed all the features one by one. So if you want to watch it, just click on the video that is on the right side of your screen. And if you guys like this video then be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I am Mr. Android and I will see you guys in the next one.